this is a framework for hazard early warning systems that can support any type of hazards. This framework is consistent with the framework that the WMO uses, the framework that United Nations Disaster Risk Reduction Agency uses for how they look at risk management and the World Health Organization framework. And the five steps, the first is risk knowledge. So it's basically understanding the risk of the hazard. And so that's the basic understanding of what the system is going to be trying to protect and what are the potential risks that could apply to people or businesses or infrastructure, what would be impacted. And then the second step is the monitoring solution. So what type of monitoring do you want to put in place to understand in real time and on an ongoing basis where the risk is actually happening and what's going on? And then the third step is dissemination and communication with either agencies that are responsible for responding or to the public. And then the fourth step is the response capability. So that's how does the, the public or the agencies respond to the situations. The fifth step is evaluation and improvements that are done. Once you have a situation where an event occurs, you want to have a process where you take what you've learned from each time an incident happens and improve your processes so that the system works better the next time 